everyone and welcome to another HD hopefully uh, video. This one's going to be a review and one of my first hardware review videos. This one is going to be a review of the case that I unboxed for the LG Voyager. So this is the uh, the hard rubberized case that I showed you guys and um, I'm just going to go over installation real quick and by the way I will not, uh, actually I will be using noise cancellation for this video and I'm using my new microphone here. So um, here we go. This is the uh, front of the phone itself and the front case, again, this is made of, uh, uh, if I can show you, it's a really soft uh, kind of a rubber feel, but it's also a hard rubber case, so it's kind of interesting. Uh, to put it on, we just put it on the phone, push down, and wait till you hear a snap. And I'm actually installing it during this video because uninstallation is a real pain. Um, I have to show you guys more about that. But uh, to put it on the back of the phone, it's the same thing. It kind of fits right over. Uh, there's little uh, hinges where you can put it on the phone and it hinges on to the, uh, the outside parts of the phone. So when you hear the clicks, that is how you know that it is done, uh, that you're done with the installation. So now that we're done installing, I can go over the, um, basically, the main features of this case. I'm going to try to move, uh, move the microphone and try, sorry about that, try to move the microphone over here. So um, what I want to show you is that the front of the case is basically you get all this room for the buttons. You get all this um, open space so you can press the send, end, and clear keys. That's pretty cool. You do get a little uh, opening there for the uh, speaker. So when you're talking on the phone, there's no obstruction there. Uh, the thing on the on this side is that you do have an open slot for the micro SD card that focuses and the uh, 2.5 millimeter headphone jack. So that's very good. On the other side, uh, it's completely open, okay? So there, there's no uh, hinges coming down on this side, and there's also, it's left wide open on the uh, the front part, so you don't have anything obstructing the hard keys on, on the top. Uh, a few things I noticed about this case. On this side, there are four, you can see those four holes. I actually went on their website, and I was just surfing it today, and I never found out what those four holes are for. It could be for ventilation, it could be for, um, for a, a, a belt holster, but I never found out. Um, if there is no belt holster in the box, so uh, that's just something to consider. And, you know, you kind of feel it when you're texting on the back because I hold my phone in a certain way that I do have my thumbs or my fingers there. So, yeah, that's an interesting feature. Um, so, yeah, this case is really, really, it doesn't take up that much room. If you are looking for a case that doesn't add that much bulk to the phone, this is not a very thick phone, as you can see. Um, it does have a flip open, but it's not a very thick phone, and this case does not add that much bulk to the phone. Um... What else can I tell you? There's not really that many features about it because it's not a belt holster. But yeah, it does cover the Verizon Wireless and the LG branding that you would normally see. So when you were, say, surfing the web, uh, you wouldn't have, there wouldn't be anything in the way. Um, even though if you're trying to touch something on the outside edge of the screen, that might be obstructed a little bit. But otherwise, that's, it, I mean, it's pretty good that you don't have anything uh, kind of distracting. Uh, so if you're browsing the web in the dark, there's nothing reflective or anything. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else can I tell you? This is really a well a well designed case. Okay, you can uh, you can get one at the link in the description. It's a very very uh, very good price. So if you do uh, visit that link, you can get this for I think ten dollars. It is. So um, yeah, I want to thank Extreme PDA for sending this out to me. It's a really really nice case. And I think this is now going to be my default case because before I was using a soft one. This is actually a better case, and it does um. It does work with my headphones, so if I do plug in the headphones there, uh, they don't fall out. Um, one last thing is that uh, in another case that I was using when I wanted to charge the phone, you kind of have to uh, bring back that charging flap there if I could uh, take it back, but I can't really do it at the moment because this, this little thing right here that latches onto the edge of the phone is in the way. So if you do want to charge it, you're going to have to take off the back part of the case, and that is kind of difficult to take off. So that is the only con. It's not a lint grabber or anything. It's just an all-around good case. So this has been another HD video from MKBHD. If you'd like to follow me on Twitter, uh, that link is in uh, on my channel, and uh, you'll get all the updates and everything. I try to update it a couple times a day. And that's basically it. So thanks for watching this video, and make sure you subscribe. Peace.